this little section here pisses me off. It's annoying me, but gotta get the show on the road right away. are all doing well. If you're a new subscriber, welcome. Hi, hello, my name is Belle Michelle. I do fashion videos, hair tutorials, as well as vlogging my travels here and there. If you're not already subscribed, I would suggest that you do subscribe. And if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. How you doing? So I hope you guys are all doing well today. So in this video, I am doing a haul from a place that I've never actually hauled before and it's Lavish Alice. When I first thought of Lavish Alice, the first thing I think of is the caped blazers. I believe I may be wrong, but I believe they were the first people to do those kind of cake blazers and those blazers put them on the map However, they have a full range of other clothing items And one thing I really like about them is that their clothing items are really really good quality and here and there I've always bought like a top or a dress from there They have wonderful dresses for weddings, which is one of the reasons why I'm doing this video We are coming up to wedding season and we are also coming up to Royal Ascot season now I actually wanted to go to Royal Ascot this year. However, I looked at the prices for Royal Ascot and like like, I was just a tad bit confused like I didn't know it's about 300 400 pounds for a ticket to go and sit on some grass and see horses race and bet money that I might lose so now I'm contemplating whether I do want to go I mean I'd much rather spend that money on a flight or something maybe not Royal Ascot I do want to go to Ascot and considering that I've kind of lived near Ascot for the past few years and I've never gone I think it's a tad bit bad like I want to go but I'm not on spending 400 300 pounds to sit on some grass and watch horses I have a few weddings to go to this year. So I went onto the Lavish Alice website to see what they have. So I have this massive box of dresses and other little bits and I'm gonna share them with you guys in this haul. The first dress that I have is this one and this is actually a dress that I've seen a few times. However, I have not seen it in this color and it's kind of this red and pink color block. I love the colors, two of my fave colors, red and pink. Nowadays, I'm really into clothes that are like bright colors. Well, I've always been into bright colors, but clothes that are bright colors and then have like a statement piece like a statement frill or something and I just think this looks so pretty it doesn't look like much right now that I'm holding it up but when I try it on you guys will see and I think this would be so perfect for a summer wedding especially a wedding that might be outside or like a British wedding or if you're going to a destination wedding and the silhouette on it as well just gives you that kind of hourglass figure comes up midi length also has a slit on the back and it's made from this scuba material and i can't believe i actually got this in their outlet section and it was 30 pounds and i was like oh my god wow i really really love this dress and i cannot cannot wait to wear it to someone's wedding but next i have another dress that's oh it's falling off the hanger I have another dress that's pretty similar to the one that I just showed you guys before but this one is off the shoulder and it is in this beautiful oh my god do you know what I'm not gonna use the hanger anymore it's in this beautiful mint green color that's washing me out right now but it's fine that just looks so amazing on my skin it's actually amazing and these kind of neon it's not really neon it's more of like a mint green but nowadays bright neon colors are really in fashion right now it has the similar statement frill piece that the dress before had as well and it is just so 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 pretty once again bodycon it's made from this scuba material again a lot of the dresses from lavish alice i believe are made from this scuba material and i love this scuba material because it's a bit like a cheat bodycon material and really like sucks you in and it just smooth everything out however it is a bit of a pain to try and iron so that's the only thing and sometimes it can get like these little I don't know if you guys can see like if you fold it in the wrong way you have these creases that are so hard to get out but apart from that love the color love the dress and this is also something that I think will look good if you're going to say ascot or the races or if you're going to a wedding as well this will look amazing absolutely amazing for a summer wedding so next up I got this bodysuit now it is very sparkly very very sparkly and i guess i didn't realize how sparkly it was when i saw it on the website like i knew it was sequined and sparkly I thought it was going to be more pure silver grayish type sparkles but they have a bit of a rainbowish color they have a bit of a rainbowish color that i hope that the camera is picking up but yeah i'm really not too fond of it at all i think if it was more of just a plain silver type sparkle i'd be happy and that's what i thought this is more of a christmasy vibe but i really really like the bodysuit however they do have it in burgundy as well so i think what i might do i was trying to get more silver in my wardrobe because i don't have a lot of silvers and grays so i wanted to 
venture into that color palette however this isn't it but what I might do I might actually purchase the burgundy one because the burgundy one looks hella nice and not in a normal situation Michelle would have purchased the burgundy one but I was trying to do something different but yeah just stay with the color scheme that you like but nevertheless it's a really nice bodysuit it's a clipped at the bottom which is perfect for if you need to go to the toilet like I said I think this will work more for Christmas periods not really Ascot or uh, mm, do you know what if you're going to an African wedding then maybe you could we wear shine shine every wedding so you could probably get away with it in one of our weddings but for like a typical British wedding I think it might look a bit tacky actually do you know what I think it's just the sparkles I just think the bodysuit looks tacky to me just because of the sparkles but if it was in another color then I think it probably would work so I got another dress and this dress is actually the dress that prompted me prompt prompted prompted me to go on the lavish Alice website and look at other things because I was actually going to purchase this dress I love it I saw it first on ASOS and they ha in ASOS they had it in a pink and white and I really wanted the pink and white but I was umming and ahhing about it and then someone else bought it and it went out of stock and I was like Ugh. so I went on the actual lavish Alice website and I saw they had it in black and white and I thought do you know what it looks so much more sophisticated and even better in black and white and it looks it doesn't look like much now that I'm holding it up but when I try it on you guys will see it is so gorgeous it has a halt in it um it's not made from the scuba material it's made of more of a really I don't know what the name of this material is but it's really thick and really good quality double layered as well which you guys know that I love and I always complain about when things aren't double layered but this is just gorgeous I think this would be more wedding appropriate or even date night appropriate I wouldn't really see it at Ascot actually if you pair it with one of those big hats that the ladies usually wear maybe it could work at Ascot yeah I think if you pair it with a big hat it could actually work at Ascot it's a beautiful beautiful dress and I love it it fits amazingly and I am so so happy that I got it okay I've, I've actually already worn this so I need to give me a few moments I need to button it back up I'm not gonna lie I don't think I, I'm bothered to actually button the whole thing up but I should you know what just so you guys can see what it actually looks like I'm gonna do all the buttons but oh this hair keeps on getting on my lip gloss you guys that wear lip gloss how do you and have hair at the front of your face how do you stop your hair um attaching to your lips or is there like nowhere to stop no way i got this off the shoulder top once again doesn't look like much on the hanger but when i try it on you guys will see and i really really love it however i got it in a size 12 and everything fits perfectly like the arms the actual body of the top fits perfectly but this bit here is a bit tight i'm not too sure about the sizing the other one thing that i don't like is the color i feel like the color does absolutely nothing for me it does nothing for my skin and it's kind of that dirty um baby blue color and yeah i'm just not a fan i think it does nothing for me although the style of the top i really really love and i actually saw something similar in zara but it was in red and it sold out and I was so upset so when I went on to Lavish Alice and I saw literally like a replica of that top I was like yes but I wish they had this in red or had it in another color because this color does absolutely nothing for my skin but the top as a whole love love the top so next I got a two-piece well they didn't come as a two-piece set they're two separates but I got um, both of them to wear together the first was the top which is a bandy top and see this is in that kind of dirty blue color but it's a bit lighter than the sh top that i showed before so it's off the shoulder but has this bit of peplum here i kind of wish the peplum went out a bit more nevertheless i still like the top and then it has this tie faux tie thing that comes down and then it comes with matching culotte trousers now i'm actually a bit disappointed in the trousers because i thought they were going to be a really thick material really good quality but it's really flimsy and the trousers don't have a lining I guess it makes them more airy but I would have preferred they have a lining they're kind of similar to culottes that I got from Uniqlo that I think I've shown in a video before I love 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 those culottes and those culottes are like really thick double layered really nice and yeah I thought these culottes were going to be the same but they're not they still look nice but they just feel a bit flimsy but I do like it and I like both of them together as a two piece and I think they're going to look very 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 cute and I'm going to keep them and you're probably going to see me wear this a lot both together and separately and they are very very comfortable when it comes to summer I love 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 culottes particularly in summer culottes and um, pleated high waisted skirts love that is me for summer and dresses as well obviously dresses dresses is me 24-7 how do you know what I forgot how many days there are. Is it 360 or 365? 
I'm smart guys, I'm smart guys, I'm like, I'm smart, I've got a first, I've got a first class degree, I'm smart. Basically, I like to wear dresses all year round, that's what I'm trying, sometimes be simple, yeah. I like to wear dresses all year round. So, those are all the items that I got from Lavish Alice, I hope you guys liked this haul and I hope you guys found a few things that you might want to purchase. Let me know which items you liked, also let me know what you think I should keep and what I should return. Like I said before, if you're new to my channel and you've got to the end of this video, then you might as well subscribe because I think you like me by now, you've watched my entire video. So please do subscribe and join my family, we are a lovely family here. And if you like this haul video, I think you might like these two haul or styling videos here, so click on one of them and just continue binge watch all my videos i hope you guys have a good morning evening afternoon or whatever time you watch this video and i'll see you all in my next video bye